today's going to be a busy day, lots to post. Um, kind of noticed a few negative comments on some of my videos. Um, kind of has me a little perplexed. So what I want to start off with first is um, the information that I'm sharing. If you at all find this helpful, then I've added a, a, a link to donate through PayPal. And what we need to start recognizing in the future is if you receive something of value to you, then you have to have the responsibility and accountability of putting some value on it. And I'm not suggesting everybody has to pay to listen to anything I've got to say. I'm only suggesting if you have the funds, even a dollar, then you're putting a value of something. You're paying it forward. And basically what my channel is all about is I see a possibility of how we can create world peace and do it by 2012. Now I can say that with an enormous confidence because I can see the path. I can see exactly what needs to be done. Um, people will disagree with that belief because they have a limited belief. They may see that this is too big of a problem. They may, they may have a lot of reasons, a lot of beliefs as to why it's totally impossible to create world peace. But my whole channel is about, let's question what we believe to be true. Anywhere you develop a belief, it came someplace. It, it came from your experiences. It came from a book. It came from a teacher. It, it came from your religion. It came from someplace. But ultimately, reality is held together by what we believe to be true. Now, I know that I can create shit pretty magically, pretty instantly, and I know exactly what it felt like. Nobody else on the planet will ever know what that felt like except for me because I was in my shoes at the time and I was really paying attention to what was going inside me at the time. Kind of really excited about it. Kind of like no matter who who disbelieved what I was saying, I knew it was going to be true. I, I had such an overwhelming belief there was not one second, not one ounce of doubt. And every time I felt that way, poof, it showed up. Now, do I believe that world peace will be created by 2012? Yeah, I believe that without a doubt. Why it's not going to happen instantly is because I have a whole pile of other beliefs that are at play. I do have a doubt of whether it would be done by 2012, and I have some beliefs behind that. I believe I'm not the only one. I believe that I need a lot more other people involved in this. I believe that I need to improve on my communication skills and share as much information as possible with as many people as possible. Um, and I need to do that within a specific period of time, and there's another aspect of the plan that needs to fall into place which you won't comprehend yet um, because you can only comprehend what you know for sure what you truly believe in and if you hear something completely different if it goes against what you believe to be true then you're going to disagree with it and you know we kind of have to say something a little different we have to say something that's completely out of our comprehension and try hard to try and understand it in order for we for us all to have that same belief system it isn't about just sitting there and feeling the luck <laughs> that doesn't work it isn't sitting there just meditating monks have been meditating for a long time didn't do them any good there is a lot of things that need to be done but what is world peace world peace means when you yes you are experiencing your peace what does world peace mean to you what does peace in your life mean that you're getting along with everybody, that there's no fighting, that you're able to pay all your bills, that you're able to get up every day and enjoy your life, you have no illnesses that you're suffering from, there's anything you want is just available to you. Is that possible or do you think that that's impossible to create? I happen to think it's possible. We have these rules that we don't believe. It's not in our comprehension right now. One of those rules that plays on our ability to believe in world peace is the fact that you can't please all the people all the time. That is not true. You can please all the people all the time. You just don't know how to do it and make that happen. 
that's part of the problem with these elites and part of the problem with a lot of our business rules is there's got to be a cost effective rule in there there's got to be um, you know a sacrifice for the greater good that has been our biggest mistake all along so we just don't know how to do it and that's what my channel is all about is to share as much information as possible I happen to believe that the more people that are experiencing hardship and problems the more people are going to want to know how to unfold their solution to their problem before in the past while we were enjoying our stuff there was only a few people that could see what was wrong you know the homeless people you know the people that are starving in Africa um, there hasn't been that many people interested I mean they were interested in solving their problems but we're all connected plus we all need information that we don't know about and the only people that knew how to solve problems were the wealthy people and the only way they knew how to solve problems is by making sure a lot of other people didn't have the same information as them but if the whole globe had the same information if the whole globe was playing the same game you can't manipulate anybody but you can be part of a system that can make just about everything happen so um, while you may disagree with me um, question what you want to believe in do you want to believe that there is a possibility for world peace because if you do what that means is you get everything you want <laughs> and you get everything you want by not doing any harm to anybody else and everybody else gets everything they want by not doing any harm to you and it is a possibility if you don't believe in it it's because you just can't see that path you just can't see the possibility and what I'm suggesting is you're just lacking a great deal of information and I'm putting a lot of information on my channel to kind of unfold how this reality is being created and how you can control this this reality and yeah a lot of it is somewhat of a meditation which means you do have to find a peace in yourself you have to be the peace but that's not going to solve all the problems you need to know how to transform problems and in the past all we've done is block and ignore all problems and uh, it's not about blocking and ignoring anymore we gotta face the big bad problems and what's down there go into the problem and stop ignoring it stop just looking at the positive shit you know like being positive all the time is not the way to go it's a matter of you're ignoring and suppressing the problems you're experiencing and just focusing on the peace and, and the happiness and you're aiming for it in stuff but you're never finding your true happiness and when you play that game out it's nothing more than a game of monopoly somebody's gonna end up on boardwalk and park place so eventually it's gonna affect you you may be happy in the short term but we're definitely haven't had the comprehension of looking at long term and again we have these you know sacrifices some people just have to die some people have to be the slaves in order for some people to really enjoy their life that mentality has to be wiped out and part of it is those who are suffering <laughs> need to learn how to ask for their value and that's one of the things I'm doing I happen to be on a welfare system don't want it I'm only here because of a lot of crimes that we do not want to fix there's a way of solving all of those but it's not going to be me stuck in that problem but more of transforming that problem and I'll get into some other videos but my worth says if you feel good about any of this information if you want to learn how to ask for what you're worth here's the example I'm saying do it yourself just like I'm doing and if this is helpful to you put some worth in it in my uh, description on my channel is uh, a link to donate through PayPal even a dollar helps me out and I'm going to unfold for you how you can tap into your purpose and how you need to start asking for your worth so that you basically never have to work another day in your life because you're going to do what you love doing just like I am I love what I'm doing starting to get donations already um, starting to attract everything that I need 
eventually I will be off this welfare system, but it's working the plan. And this is more of uh, my diary, so you can all see the development of my plan. I didn't ask for money when I started it, but I'm asking for it now. I'm developing the plan. So if you like what you hear, please donate and start finding your purpose because world peace involves you and you need to learn how to make your peace happen without doing harm to anybody else. Peace out.